my mom is a breast cancer survivor. Hip hip hooray. I know. So this is especially um, wonderful for me to have the opportunity to be here today and with all these great people from Oakwood and all of you. So, Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we had at the twilight's last gleaming. It's been 19 years so far with this event. What has it been like to see the Women's Health Care Classic through since its inception? Well, it's absolutely incredible, really, if you think about it. When we started this 19 years ago, a group of 20-some women decided we wanted to get together and do something good for women's health and good for women's golf. And little did we know that we would still be playing golf <laughs> 19 years later and raising over $4.4 million, not counting this year. You've been with this event for a few years. What keeps you coming back every year? I think it's a wonderful cause and it's a great day for women to be together. I can't think of a better way to contribute to charity and have a good time and you know be with friends. Everybody's here to do whatever they can for us. If it isn't ice cream, it's Millie shortbread. <laughs> I'll take a little one this time. Oh, well, I have plenty. As a healthcare administrator, I know that we can't provide all of the services necessary for women in our community. So we need help. We need help from uh, everybody in the community uh, through philanthropy. We care about our community, the people that live within the community, and it's an honor for companies to support and provide sponsorship. We had a great day both down at TPC and up here, and it was uh, perfect for golf. Early detection is so important. I'm an eight-year breast cancer survivor, and so I feel strongly about making sure that people get in and get their tests done. I would not be here today without the help of a great medical team, a lot of compassionate support from a loving family and friends, and people like you who give so generously of your time and money. Now that I'm with the Women's Health Services and I talk to the physicians and I see the patients and these people say, I, I had money, I got a coupon to buy a wig because I lost my hair through chemo, or I was able to buy a book that would help support me when I was having a tough time, or get transportation, whatever that need might be. What a difference we make coming out and playing golf, and what a difference it makes in the lives of a lot of women in our community and has for years, and hope, hopefully for years to come. It's a beautiful course. Uh, the weather cooperates, uh, and it really is something you should, as a community member, think about participating in. Very well done here. Join us for the 20th anniversary.